Hey, Jeffy Kane here with another question in topic 7.1. We're looking at half-life. Uh, this is uh, a question taken out of a, a larger section, uh, so the, the sentence doesn't make a lot of sense on its own. But what it's saying is that for a, a particular decay, uh, the half-life is two seconds. For that type of decay, what percentage of the original sample remains after 10 seconds? We have a couple of different equations that we can use to describe decay. And probably the simplest is that some thing at the moment is equal to some original amount of the thing times one half to the power of the number of half-lives elapsed. So this might be the original number of atoms, and this is the current number of atoms after n half-lives. This is the original mass, and this is the current mass after n half-lives. What we're going to say is that this is the original percentage and this is the current percentage remaining. Uh, if this is the original percentage, then we're going to start with 100% of, uh, of the sample. Uh, and we'll multiply that by 1 half to the power of the number of half-lives elapsed. Well, if the half-life is 2 seconds and 10 seconds have occurred, 5 half-lives fit in that window of time. 2 seconds plus 2 seconds plus 2 seconds plus 2 seconds plus 2 seconds is 10 seconds. So that's 5 lots of 2 seconds, that's 5 half-lives. Uh, punch that into your calculator and you get about 3.1%. That means 3.1% uh, of the sample remains or 96.9% uh, of the sample has decayed.